takeaway of our article is that there has been a 2.5 percent per annum decline in death due to mitral regurgitation of it. There has been an overall 35 percent decline in the last 20 years. However, in the last five years, we're seeing an increase in mortality due to mitral regurgitation at nearly 1.5 percent, which is quite worrying. This change uh, in the mortality pattern was consistent across the subgroups of age, sex, race, urbanization status, which makes this finding very rigorous and at the same time encourages us to pursue to look into what are the determinants of this change in mortality pattern in the United States. This study has very high clinical implications since mitral regurgitation has a prevalence of nearly 2 to 10 percent among individuals more than 75, 75 years of age. This video content is copyrighted by Mayo Foundation for Medical Education and Research.